Hey guys, Justin here, and this is my 2021 Harley Davidson Pan America. I installed and went out and used the Black Dog Cycle Works foot pegs, and let me tell you, massive difference. The OEM ones are cool and they work well, and I think for right off the factory floor, it's a good little foot peg. But having this big platform to be able to have for leverage and to be able to stand on for hours at a time if you're doing off-road, is like night and day difference. I mean, it really, it's like you steer the bike through your feet, especially when you're off-road. And again, these are nice, but just not the best for doing it for all day or being really aggressive, I feel like, on off-road. Anyway, let's get into the instructions on how to set up your foot pegs on the bike. In order to install the foot pegs, you're going to need the foot pegs. You're going to need the pins to install them. You're gonna need the cutter keys. And then as far as tools go, you're gonna use the screwdriver to push out the old pins, the OEM pins. You're also going to need needle nose pliers and an Allen key. The Allen key is used to install the traction pins and these are the traction pins. It's important to note the orientation of the spring here because we're going to be reinstalling the spring exactly the same way as it's currently installed with the OEM pegs. So inside the peg here, you'll see there's a small hole. That's where the spring fits in. Then we're gonna take our new retaining pins, which will take a cotter key. Okay, and then the last step is we're going to Install our cotter key. Okay, let's repeat the same process for the other side. To install the foot peg on the other side, it is the same process. All right, let's get into installing the traction spikes. Included are six, well actually 12 traction spikes for both pegs. Basically these traction spikes, if you don't know what they're used for, if you are in more wet conditions, uh, going through water, going through mud, then putting these traction spikes on can help quite a bit. If you're in desert areas, it may not make as much sense to have the traction spikes on. I am in Southern California and generally I'm doing a lot of my riding in more arid kind of climates where I don't necessarily need these. And the only downside to putting these traction spikes on is that it can wear the bottom of your boots down a little bit. So uh, if you don't need them, maybe don't install them. I'm not going to, but I do want to show you how to do it. So the first thing that you'll do is that there is some included Loctite. You'll take the Loctite, you'll just wipe a little bit on the bottom four threads or so, and then you're going to, from the top, screw the traction spike in and you'll get it as far down as you can. Then you'll take the included Allen key and you'll tighten it the rest of the way down. As far as the tightness, you know, just good and tight, doesn't need to be crazy tight on here, but you don't want it to rattle out also. Now that we have the installation complete, here's a fun little fact. There's actually a bottle opener on the bottom of these foot pegs, which you can crack a nice cold drink and enjoy after a ride. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any questions, comments, please make sure you write them in the comments below. Like and subscribe our channel. We'll be having more stuff on the Pan America. And also, if you are interested in a pair of these, well, not these, but those uh, foot pegs, go to blackdogcycleworks.com. Kurt, the owner, is a really nice guy, and it is top-notch quality.